Are they gonna stop clapping? I, I don't think they will. Either way, welcome, welcome, welcome everybody to BSG Annual 2019. Oh, I can't. It's already been a year since it, the last it's one. It's been that's... it's been such a blast, but we have. We have had quite a change in the past year. I mean, you might have already seen it a little bit mm -hmm. around, but this isn't battle. No, we're currently in a different venue, an even better venue, at least. So I far, mean, it's been pretty good. It's been. But, but we'll see throughout so the week what the <laughs> else is going to happen. You'll sure, never know. For sure. But for yeah. the first time in BSG history, we actually get to do this from a hotel over in Venray, the Netherlands. So. Uh, yeah, I guess first, first and foremost, a huge shout out to the people from the hotel for uh, supporting us and getting us a venue. Yeah, and we've oh got. My God. Yeah, I'm so excited for everything that's going to happen. Yeah, it's uh, <laughs> it's going to be a fantastic week. We've got a lot of cool runs uh, planned for you guys. So, I mean, we might as well get started with the run, shall we? Yeah. Any well, any specific ones that pop up right away? Well, I'm, I know you're a big fan of the Pokemon games as well, but the opening run that we got coming up in a moment, the Diamond and Pearl, any percent run, it's, that's so good. It's a really fun run for sure. You, you think for a moment, like, is this is a regular Pokemon run, run, but like at about an hour in, then it's just... Oh, we're having a little bit... Of feedback on the speakers. A little bit of feedback, they're working on it already. <laughs> um, but yeah, yeah, we've got throughout the week we've got we've got a bunch of randomizers coming. The, mm -hmm. the, there's a very big one coming up, uh, like yeah. about halfway through, I want to say. Yeah, the link to the past and Super Metroid crossover randomizer co-op relay, not relay co-op race. Yeah, I hope I well, said all the things correctly. Yeah, something like that. It's two teams <laughs> of two people, one doing Link to the Past, one doing Super Metroid, and then racing the other team in a randomizer setting. It's gonna be, it's gonna, that that one's definitely gonna be amazing. Mm -hmm. uh, and of course, there are plenty of other fantastic runs. These are just yeah. two we quickly picked out, but there are yeah. so many cool runs coming up. But be yeah. sure to check the schedule, see uh, which ones you enjoy. And uh, during these runs, we've got some incentives coming as well. Yes, we do. For There's like throughout the entire week, we've got many, many incentives coming up. But I quickly want to highlight the first two that are coming up. The first one is actually going to be for the second run already of this marathon for Ninja Gate in Black uh, by Shui Bear. He's, it is a, cho a choice for an outfit. I think you've got five different choices or four. Anyway, that one is going to be close off at the start of that run so that one is actually coming up pretty soon so if you want to it's only like an hour and a half away or something it's exactly it's really not much so yeah that one's coming up really really soon so if you want to see some cool outfits which uh, which a ninja is going to be wearing that one's a good in incentive to go for and later tonight we actually got one of your incentives actually yeah like we've got for the lufia 2 run we've got the name incentive for the main character we've got uh and we've got two goals uh, one of it, which is to do the entire run without any RNG manipulation, which uh, makes the run quite interesting compared to, uh, to to actually manipulating every fight. Lots of less RNG, I guess. Uh, it's definitely. <laughs> uh, normally, we manip a bunch of like one in eight drops and whatnot. Mm. Uh, it's it, it's interesting having to do that without it. And additionally, there is an incentive to pick up an extra extra party member of sorts, a capsule monster. And we've actually been talking about this, and we're actually not going to be picking up the same ones either. We're going to go Ooh. for different ones. So that's going to be a very interesting, uh, interesting one as well. So those are, uh, those are open for later tonight. And then there's plenty more coming yes. later on in the week. But I want to also mention something else that has to do with donations, which is our stretch goal of... Uh, reaching a certain donation because we actually we mentioned during the schedule release that it's going to be a bonus game uh, uh, is going to be on the schedule and we're finally revealing it it's, it's going to be go ahead uh, <laughs> I hope I say this correctly it's Barney's hide and seek no no controller or something yeah, like that no, no controller uh, co-op or something like yeah, that yeah something it's weird like that with the crowd with no controller so it's gonna be it's gonna be quite something mm -hmm. it'll be about halfway through the marathon yes uh, and in order to get that in you actually like you can use uh, we we don't actually use the donations for that specific goal but rather the total sum of donations raised up to that point if we reach uh, four thousand that's about halfway through the marathon uh, by that point, you can find it in the schedule. 
will be doing the no controller Barney's hide and seek co-op with the crowd. Yes, that's gonna be really, really cool. So definitely keep your eyes out for that. Definitely get your donations in for that as well. And should we mention a little bit about the charity that we're raising money for? Uh, yeah, for sure, because we are currently raising money for the Dutch Cancer Society. We've been working with them for a few years already. Uh, it's a nationwide organization. Uh, that is committed to fighting cancer as well, uh, you know, aiming for more cure as well as a higher quality of life for those already battling the disease. But all of your donations will be going to the Dutch Cancer Society, so just another reason to get them in. Yes, and <laughs> I believe you have some more reasons. I have that another you might reason. Want to because do we, some donations. Yeah, we actually have some prizes for you guys. We actually have two running today, which are only going to be available today. Uh, one of which is, you might have already seen it before we uh, before we started this, it's going to be for a uh, Legend of Zelda titanium ring. Uh, and there is going to be a uh, donation for a canvas for one of the Super Smash characters. Ooh. Those are only going to be available, I believe, up until Pokemon Typing Adventure, if I'm hey. saying it correctly. <laughs> That's your run. Yeah. Um, every single day we'll have different incentives or different prizes to go for. And additionally, we've got one grand prize coming at the end of the week, which is open to everybody, even those that don't donate. Uh, you can find it under exclamation mark grand prize. I'm uh, quickly going to look over at the host to see if he can put that in chat. Um, oh, 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 I just saw from the moderation team that I got a thumbs up. So uh. Ah, fantastic. <laughs> so uh, to participate, you just have to follow the link there. It'll contain all of the prizes that we'll be handing out throughout the week. Uh, and uh, as a little bit of an incentive, though, for you to donate, if you do want to, to donate, is uh, everybody that does donate over the course of the event gets a three times higher odds of winning. So you do actually get some bonus out of that. But even if you can't donate, you you can always... Uh, you can still always, win those wonderful you, you, cool you, prizes. Yeah, you can still win uh, win that way. So a lot, of, a lot of cool stuff there. And I, I just want to give a huge shout out to Nintendo Core, which is a, a merch store who does a bunch of Nintendo goodies as well as several other uh, merchandise. Uh, they, they are the ones sponsoring all of these prizes for us. So uh, a huge thank you to, uh, to Nintendo Core for that. Speaking of sponsors, I think we have a few more that we need to mention yeah, before definitely. we go over. Uh, one I uh, want to mention first is the one where we're not at our venue at the moment, but I want to give a uh, quick shout out to uh, the Esports Game Arena in Alpha and the Rhein. Uh, they've actually provided us with quite a few of the monitors that we're using during this event. So without them, we would have not have we, a lot we, of... We would, have, we would have been struggling, that's for sure. They, <laughs> they came out at the last moment when it, it seemed like we weren't going to be able to make anything else work. And they provided us with a bunch of additional monitors, just you know, making sure that we have enough for the stream as well as for the practice areas. So huge shout outs to the esports game arena for that. Mm -hmm. um, um, also, oh, uh, sorry. Uh, also, uh, yeah, shout outs also to Twitch, like uh, like they're letting us being able to uh, use their platform to stream this on, and also providing us with some other additional things like pro providing uh, front page. Uh, time so yeah definitely super great for them as well uh, for them to what is going on in the crowd <laughs> I, I have no idea either way there is one last uh, one last one that I do want to shout out I mean you guys probably all know and love them but I want to give a huge shout out for the ESA crew for uh, supporting the event once again and letting us mm -hmm. uh, stream our second annual on the on the ESA channel uh, so yeah thank you for all of the the parties involved in just making this happen and uh, I do think we're going to be moving on soon, if I'm not forgetting yeah. anything. I think we mentioned everything that we should. Otherwise, we'll mention more stuff. Yeah, we'll, we'll be... You'll we'll be hearing our wonderful volunteers tell more about just... Just about everything things. as we go uh, <laughs> yeah. as we go along. So yeah, have fun with uh, Pokemon Diamond and Pearl. They'll be coming up in a moment after we do a, a quick little bit of setting up still. And uh, yeah, enjoy the event.